Hey guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to do a fake you roll out. Alright, so if you don't know, this trick is basically just riding backwards and turning yourself around. It's the first trick you're going to want to learn because if you don't know how to do this, you won't know how to do anything. So, once you do it, it's going to look something like this. For this trick, you're going to want to use a hill because it's easier to fake using a hill. And what I do is I foot jam this. For a foot jam, you stick your foot in the right in between the forks and the tire. So it goes like this and it sends your back end up. You don't want to do it like this because then you get your toe caught and like break your toe or something. So um, what you want to do is go up the hill, put your foot in, bring the back end up, when you land, you're gonna wanna pedal backwards, unless you have a free coaster. If you have a free coaster, just ride backwards. And you're gonna wanna go a little faster than it automatically goes, because if you go at the same speed, you'll lose balance, you'll be going way too slow to actually do the trick. And once you get, let's say you do it, your foot's gonna be like this, and then when you land, when you're about this much through, you're going to want to put pedal pressure and it'll help you lift it up. Turn your head, turn your head and turn your bars and it'll send you this way. And once you get here, just pedal and act like it was your first time doing it and look like a total boss. Also, if you're on a free coaster, because of the slack, you can't really do pedal pressure. And I don't know really how to help you on that because I've never ridden a free coaster before. And I don't know what to do with that. It's good to do it. I don't know if you can see it, but it, this is a steeper hill. The steeper it is, the better it is to do it. Because once you go backwards, it sends you backwards faster. And if you're going faster, it's easier to control your bike and do the fakie. For a fakie, just put your foot and pedal a little faster. Then it automatically goes. When you're doing the trick, learning it, you want to go like medium pace. Because if you go too fast, you'll bring your front end up, your back end up, way too much because you're still not used to controlling how high to bring your back tire up. So you'll just jam your foot in and completely flip over. If you're riding and you go too high and you don't know how to bail, you're going to bust your face. If you go too high, just kind of push the bars under you and just take your foot off the wheel because if you don't if you don't take your foot off when you go up too high your foot's gonna get stuck and you're gonna go like face first into the ground so make sure to take your foot off the tire one key is to turn your head always turn your head the way you're spinning out if you don't turn your head you're not gonna spin just to regard, this isn't my um, garage, it's my neighbor's. So, All right. When you're turning your head, turn your head towards your shoulder and look at where you want to go. So look like right behind your back tire because that's where you want to land. If you're looking at like right here, you're only going to land right here. You're not going to get the full turn. And there's not just like this, there's sliders and like half cabs and stuff. The more you do it, the more you get used to it. And, like, there's a variety of stuff you can do. And these are generally really easy. It took me about like a week to learn how to do them. So if you do it like every day, you can learn it within a week.